So about uh, 2.30 in the morning, just this morning, um, I broke my pipe. And uh, that one store is open 24 hours and it's only $3. So I hopped on the bike and I went down uh, to get a new pipe. And, you know, spontaneous me, I rode all the way down to Cherry Beach. Uh, you know, to fool around in the bushes with some strangers, but it never happened, so who cares. Um, anyway, so in the morning, I, as the sun come up, I see that there's numerous, numerous boozy cans everywhere. So I thought, I didn't bring a grocery bag, because uh, I didn't intend to do this, but um, I started collecting them. So my backpack that I just washed yesterday is full, and uh, I, I found a green bag, you know, somebody else's shopping bag, um, that I'm filling up now. And I'm at Cherry Beach. When I look at the beach, uh, something, my heart flutters uh, because uh, this is where Mike had that low sugar and uh, this is where he grabbed my head and kissed me and says that he didn't care who was looking at him or if anybody was paying attention, he felt that he needed to kiss me and he did. I don't know if that was a lie, you know, because everything else about him is a lie. I just, when I see the beach here, I just, it makes me feel so betrayed, so gullible and stupid and foolish, you know, how did I not see it? I did see it numerous times. I even asked. I didn't accuse. I asked. And, you know, he turned it around on to me. And I didn't know no better. I mean, the day that he, this, that day I was talking about, he did get a low blood sugar. He was sweating and I told him to sit down before he falls down and embarrass himself because people will think he's drunk. And, uh, and about the ice cream and, you know, and he was better after a small nap in the car. It, so I know that part wasn't fake and none of his low blood sugars were fake. But the words that come out of his mouth, I don't know if they were real, you know. Uh, I'm just walking around looking or picking up boozy cans. Like, I don't know if anything that he said was the honest truth. And, um, and where did the lies start? When did they start? Do you know? Um, was the whole thing, like from the very, very get-go, the beginning, it was all lies. I mean, I, when I saw that Facebook thing and that woman um, says, I'll see you tonight. Now that was like the second day after our second date because I had took that picture that he posted. So, you know, makes me think that he, he was cheating on me right from the get-go. I don't understand. I gave him everything, you know, everything. Anything he wanted, I gave him. He either asked, no, he always asked, and I always gave. I even worked double shifts to give him stuff. I sent him to school with fucking uh, lunch monies. You know, he got parking tickets, I fucking paid them. Oh, everywhere you go, there's campers. I didn't know which trail to go down earlier because there's campers everywhere. So, you know, I just, being down here at Cherry Beach, uh, really um, brings back some memories. Nostalgia is what I'm feeling, I guess. If that's the word, nostalgia. I'm not having very good luck right now. I washed my hands, I'm gonna have some cookies. I brought cookies uh, with me so that the fucking coons didn't get them. Cause you know, they fucking eat everything. And if they don't eat it, they fucking wreck it so I can't eat it. Anyway. It was just a note letting me know how me feels when I'm down here. I wasn't even going to stay this long. Uh, there's one, to be honest with you. See, I have to go into the bushes to get this shit. So, anyway. Bye.